Is there a functional macOS equivalent to a Windows DLL? A DLL is similar to a folder, but it allows for multiple programs slash executables to access it at once, thus conserving memory, I think. What is Mac's equivalent of a DLL? I was looking through the Google Chrome folders inside slash library slash application support, and instead of the regular Windows default.dll there was just a folder, default as a regular file, with contents, I assume, would regularly be inside the DLL. Does the Mac equivalent provide the same function? The equivalents to a Windows DLL on OS X are Frameworks, Coco, or Dilibs, BSD. The system supplied ones are in slash usr slash lib and slash system slash library slash frameworks respectively. The folder you mention, library slash application support is similar to the application data or app roaming now, folders and windows containing your application's personal settings. While I don't know what the equivalent for Chrome's default DLL on OS X is, the application bundle contains the following. Guessing from the size, it looks like Google Chrome framework might be important the folder frameworks just above doesn't contain much of interest. There's no real DLLs in OS X, Linux, or any POSIX for that matter. They don't make the differentiation. Why? A lot of Mac stuff, for one, is self-contained, dot apps are really just folders after all. The binaries in Mac OS X and Linux and other asterisk nixes use the ELF, which stands for executable and library format for both libraries and executables. The default file that you found in there was probably an ELF binary. Update, DMC key points out that .dilibs are under the Mac O format exclusive to Macs. It's hard to distinguish the two by sight, however, because neither of them actually require any extension. The closest Linux and Mac equivalents are called shared object files, usually taking a.so extension, and dynamic libraries, usually taking a.dilib extension. Shared objects are used extensively on typical Linux systems. Dynamic libraries are not quite as ubiquitous because the .app format allows a very safe distribution mechanism for supporting multiple architectures at the cost of larger executable files. <laughs> Thank you so much.